Good everyone, you're watching Radio Fixes. In this video, I'm going to talk about how to fix the DirectX error could not allocate sufficient memory in Windows 11. At times, when you're working on your Windows machine or playing high performance game, you might come across the DirectX error, the one which you're seeing on the screen. Now, there are a couple of steps to get this issue resolved. Now, the method one is to increase the paging file size in your Windows machine. To do this, you can go ahead and click on the search. In the search, go ahead and type view advanced system settings. You will see the best match for the view advanced settings. Click on it to open the uh, advanced system settings. Under this, click on the advanced tab. Once you're on the advanced tab, go ahead and click on settings under performance. Under this, Click on the advanced tab again and uh, make sure you have adjust for best performance of programs and then click on change. Once you are on change, uncheck the box which says automatically manage paging file size for all drivers and then choose custom size. Under this, what you will have to do is you will have to choose the initial paging file size and maximum size. Now for the recommendation, the initial size should be one and a half times size of your RAM and the maximum size needs to be three times of your RAM. Now, how do you find it? To do this, uh, you will have to open the system properties. You can do a right click on the start button and then click on system. In case if you are if you know how much is your RAM, you can go ahead and update it. So in my case, the RAM size is 8 GB. So if it is 1.5 GB, uh, 1.5 times. It, so the initial size can be uh, 12,000 MB and the maximum size could be uh, three times the RAM that is 12 into 3 is uh, 36,000 MB that is 3, uh, 36,000 megabytes. You may go ahead and click on set and then click on OK. Once it is done, restart your computer and check if your issue has been resolved. If it is resolved, well and good, you don't have to try the next step. Now, as a next step, uh, what you can also do is you can go ahead and clear the DirectX cache on your computer. So to do this, uh, what you will have to do is uh, in the search box, you will have to go ahead and type disk cleanup. Double click on the disk cleanup option. Now you would see a disk cleanup tool on your screen. Under this, make sure you go ahead and check the box for direct x shader cache and then click on ok and then if you are prompted to delete the files permanently click on delete files this will go ahead and delete all the temporary files and the disk shader cache direct x shader cache on your computer once that is done you may go ahead and close the window and check if your issue has been resolved if your issue has been resolved well and good you don't have to try the next step the third step is to go ahead and update or reinstall your graphic driver to do this you will have to do a right click on the start button and then click on device manager once you are on the device manager you will have to look uh, look for display drivers under the device manager click expand the device manager now in case if you have a graphic card installed you would see two different display drivers in my case i have a graphic card so you can choose the default one this is the default or inbuilt graphic card so you can do a right click on the uh, default graphic card and click on update driver choose the option which says search automatically for drivers and the next option you you can choose is search for updated drivers on windows update what this will do is it will go ahead and check if there are any graphic card drivers available through the windows update you may go ahead and click on check for the updates in case if there are any updates available go ahead and install those updates restart your computer and check if your issue resolved if your issue resolved well and good you don't have to uh, worry about any step so in this should definitely fix a problem in spite of trying all this step and if you're still facing a problem i would suggest you to leave me a comment in the comment section so that i can come up with the possible solution i hope this video was useful in case if you like this video please make sure to hit the like button and do not forget to subscribe to my channel thank you have a great day